Alrighty guys, welcome back to another LEGO Polybag review from Brick and today we have another one of the LEGO Movie 2 Polybags. This is Emmett's Peace Offering. Uh, set number 30340, contains 44 pieces and one minifigure. This Polybag was available at both Walmart and Target, and Target it was part of the seasonal uh, Valentine's section. Uh, it was their you know, seasonal Polybag. Um, and, you know, it kind of sold out quickly in my area, so I didn't get it there. But I did end up finding it at Walmart, where I don't think it was seasonal. I think it was just a random, like, one of the poly bags that they put out. At least it wasn't in a seasonal section where I found it. But maybe it was put out there specifically as a seasonal item, and this Walmart just put it in a weird spot. The build of the poly bag is very, very simple. It is a heart, and this is the peace offering from the beginning of the movie. This was shown on a TV spot, so not really a spoiler. Um, but, uh, you know, if you haven't seen the movie and you don't want to know anything, skip forward about five seconds. But this is the uh, little thing that Emmett builds and gives to the Duplo creatures at, uh, you know, at the very beginning of the movie in like the first five minutes. And, you know, it, for what it is, it is actually 100% screen accurate. Looks exactly as it did in the movie. And looks the same front and back, really. It's, uh, except for that 1x2 section there that's different on the back. Well, I guess this color is different on the back in most places, but you know, for the most part, it is exactly the same front and back. Very simple. Uh, lots of funky colors, which is kind of interesting. But, you know, it's other than the colors, these are basic bricks, really. Um, yeah, I mean, it is what it is. It looks like it does in the movie. And, um, again, minor spoilers, I'm not going to actually tell you anything, but skip forward just a little. Um, this does play a pretty big role in the movie, way bigger than I was expecting. So, you know, it's kind of a cool build to get. But, uh, you get one minifigure included in the set. And the Emmett minifigure featured here. This is nothing special. It is the same exact version of Emmett that appears in the um, the Build and Fix Workshop, the 4 Plus set, and Emmett's Dreamhouse slash Rescue Rocket. Uh, same exact design. Uh, and, you know, it's the LEGO Movie 2 version, so the silver on the torso is kind of nicked up a little uh, by design, not, you know, uh, accidentally. It's not like a production error or anything. But it looks uh, look, looks pretty good. You know, he's the least changed from the first movie, so honestly you could use a stand-in, basically, from the first film. Uh, but his face print is new here. I like this expression, kind of confident little smile. And then this expression is really cool, the angry, determined one. Yeah, that's nice. Uh, good figure. Nothing crazy, but, you know, it's Emmett. Also, that hairpiece is, you know, still cool. Always has been. Probably always will be. At first glance, this poly bag is nothing special, but if you've seen the film, I think, you know, you will probably enjoy this poly bag a little bit more. Uh, and, you know, due to its significance in the movie, which I don't want to talk too much about, I do think that this is a pretty cool poly bag to get. And, you know, after seeing the movie, I, you know, kind of was out and about looking, trying to find this poly bag because I wanted to add it to my collection. So, you know, in that aspect, they uh, were pretty effective at advertising. So, you know, uh, that that's a good thing, I think, probably. But for $4, I don't think this is a bad buy. I mean, you know, you get 40 pieces. Yes, they're pretty simple, but they do build this cool little thing, which, you know, on its own, looks fine. And, you know, with the movie significance, I think is is pretty great. Uh, Emmett, you know, cool figure, but pretty common uh, for the most part. He's in a lot of sets, his torso and legs. The face print is a little bit less common. It's not the one that they use for a ton of promotional stuff, like, you know, all the other poly bags that he's in, plus the Super Baby Pack and all the other smaller promotional stuff, plus a bunch of the regular sets. At least it's not that face print, so, you know, in that regard, I'm happy. Um, but yeah, you know, pretty cool, and I would definitely recommend it uh, for $4 if you see it as a, you know, little impulse buy item from Lego Movie 2. So if you guys enjoyed uh, this little review, if you did, let me know in the comment section down below, and I'll see you guys all next time. Bye, everyone.